San Diego has been categorized as an outdoor sports city. And while that easily explains the popularity of tennis here, it doesn't do a thing to explain racquetball. Because in the past year, practically overnight, San Diegans have flipped for this basically indoor sport. Racquetball is a very hard hitting game. Uh, we have a lot of people that play tennis and a lot of football players, baseball players that, that need the workout, that really like to get in here and break out a sweat. Like tennis, it's played in singles or doubles by both men and women, armed with small rackets and a tiny rubber ball. And that's where the similarity stops. Instead of a net, you play racquetball up against the front wall of the court, using the other three walls for ricochets. The key, as any good racquetball player will tell you, is position. The person that controls the middle of the court usually wins the rally and eventually will tire out the other opponent and eventually will win the game. Equipment is important and part of the boom that now surrounds the sport is generated by heavy sales of rackets, balls, gloves and shoes. Racquetball clubs are springing up all over San Diego to handle the thousands of new players. Even so, it's still difficult to get a court. How many people do you have here? You've been open one month only. Uh, we have anywhere from 200 to 300 members. In just one month? Yes. Are you still expanding? or? Do... Well, we're trying to hold it down because we're going to end up running the public app. So we're, uh, we're accepting applications, but we don't want to overdo the membership. takes a lot of time. What was the score? Well, gee, I think it was 21-0, but I think it was, ended up 21-1. Okay, 21-1. This is Gene Gleason, TV8 News in Rose Canyon.